Major Slack Attack. Still no higher thugs. Getting bomb. nervous. Vamp? The Imperials think us all lawless beasts. I'm proof of their ignorance. It's, it's like getting to the point where I'd rather the hired thug it's show up than like sure keep me in suspense, sure, you know? Sure I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Good day. And then show up at the most inopportune moment. Let me know if there's anything up you need. Like now. <laughs> nope. Okay, here we go, people. Never ending destruction. Oh, and our soul gems respond here. Let's yank out a ring and a necklace. We got everything we need. Okay, let's just do a dry run here. I want to make sure that the only things that we can enchant is what we want to enchant. So I'm not fumbling around because I've only got one potion. Okay. guys go that can be disenchanted Perfect. Just the four items we want to enchant. Okay, here goes. Let me just do a hard save just in case something goes really horribly wrong. And a quick save. Okie dokie. Now, uh, everybody quiet on the set here. I gotta get all four enchantments in one potion. Okay, here we go. I knew those grade 9 typing classes would come in handy someday. Okay, so let's take a little look. See, 24%, 24%, 24%, 24%. It is happening. We got ourselves a destruction mate. And we're going to keep the original apprentice, glo apprentice gloves, but we can sell the other old gear to buy the fireball spell. Let's go do that right now. Mirabelle does a spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them. Okay, it's going to cost us a thousand and eight gold, and this is going to sell conveniently enough for a thousand and twelve gold or thereabouts. Thousand and twelve. Go to books. Fireball. Thousand and four gold. My, my bad. And mm -hmm. there we go. We got just enough. Down to books. Goblet down. Got yourself a fireball spell. Check out destruction, and we're not going to achieve total like zero cost spell reduction with fireball, but we will with firebolt. Fireball though. Um, we can pump out a whopping 30, I believe it was 34, I counted, 34 dual cast of fireballs before running out of magicka. So, and that is enough to kill a mammoth. 
So that's pretty much we're ready to rock. Completely ready to rock. We gotta make some money. Best way to make money is to join the Thieves Guild and we're not gonna do what some of you may be thinking I'm gonna do. We're actually gonna start working for the Thieves Guild. Doing jobs and whatnot. And I'm unlo blah, unlocking fences and the whole nine yards. It starts off by talking to Brynjolf, who's just arriving at work. Hey, Brynjolf. Glad to see you finally came to your set. Okay, what so, do I have to do? Once you have it, I want you to place it in Branche's pocket without him noticing. Okay, steal Medesi's ring and place it in Branche's pocket. There's someone that wants to see him. The details doesn't matter to us because we're not going to do it. I'm ready. Let's get this started. Wait until I start the distraction. Then show me what you're made of. Please, I need but a septum. Okay, but we could do this by activating the tower stone and then waiting 24. That probably wouldn't work. Actually, we could use the tower stone to open that, and then we could just get Medesi's ring, which is in another strong box right there, which I don't believe we have to pick a lock to get into. Or we could just purposely fail the quest by fast traveling to Markarth, which is easier. There we go, quest failed, and then go back, talk to Brynjolf to give you a little slap on the wrist, but then he'll still let you continue the Thieves Guild quest line. Hey Brynjolf, sorry about that, I had to go wee wee. <laughs> um, how long did you expect me to keep those people distracted? I had to let the whole plan fall through. Oopsie well, at daisy. Least you didn't do anything stupid. Next time when you're given a job, don't wander. Okay, bump skip. Hustle up here. Nah, my organization's been having a run of bad luck, but I suppose that's just. Well, how that's it why goes. you're in a bad mood. Okay. But never mind that. Even though you fouled up the job, I still think you've got the spark I'm looking for. All right, what well, next? You, the group I represent has its home in the Ratway beneath Riften. Get there in one piece, in one right? Piece. And we'll see if you've really got what it takes. All right, very good. I can do that. We're packing the fireball spell. Let's go into the thieves guild and cook things up. Okay, you got to be careful here. Make sure that you're dual casting. Don't let these guys get close to you. Do a quick save. And sometimes. Down there is Hewden Blackskeever and Giraffe. We can just do some area of effect damage, which is pump down fireballs down there, and then when they appear, go hard at them. Don't let them approach, and don't let Giraffe start shooting arrows at you. And I really should have... Um... Yes. And this often happens to the low light. It's way back in the other room. He'll get in on the action. He's really... Uh, even the Skeever's in on the action. This is nuts. How about John the Fist? Is he going to come up too? I've never seen the Skeever come up here. That doesn't make sense at all. Even the... Uh, here comes John the Fist. This is unbelievable. Everybody's going to come up here. <laughs> okay, I don't want to take in this. I'm just gonna be careful, peek around the corner here, make sure that John the Fist doesn't take me by surprise. Okay. Okay. Yeah, even the low life getting up here doesn't make sense because the drawbridge is still up. And everything else is like, you know, the door is still shut and locked, and it doesn't make sense, but whatever, we'll give it to the game. The game wants to cheat, no problem. Make sure you pump a fireball in there to sell off, set off the oil slick. And I can see the red dot on the radar. There's John the Fist, here he comes. Is he walking through the fire? Oh, it's, this, it's another skeever. Oh, I know. The first skeever was the skeever that's typically fighting the low life, and the second skeever is the skeever's in there. That that's in there. Okay, Jean the Fist. This is open the door here. Back off. Get some distance. Load up a dual cast fireball. Keep him at bay. And 
it's a done deal. Watch out for these berry traps here. And there might be some valuable potions over here. Can't use that. Sometimes there's two. Not this time. John the Fist. Has a couple of things we can disenchant. Make sure you grab that. Another way you can kill John the Fist is um, there's a pressure plate up here, which is a trap. It's a log trap. So this is really easy. You just run him right through, get him chasing you, right? Run right to make sure you run up the right side of the stairs so you don't hit the pressure plate. Get to the top of the stairs. When J John the Fist gets to the bottom of the stairs, step on the pressure plate, and that'll be the perfect timing just to release the log trap, which will swing across, clunk him in the head, and instantly kill him. That's the only way of killing him. All right, there you go. Let's grab that, and we can put this away. Should be a dagger on the table here. Let's grab that, and it's a done deal. Let's go to the Thieves Guild. are over. Well, well. Color me impressed, lad. I wasn't certain I'd ever see you again. Yeah, there's no problem getting here was easy. Reliable and headstrong? You're turning out to be quite the prize. So, now that I've whetted your appetite with our little scheme at the market... What do we do next? How about handling a few deadbeats for me? Alright, what do they do? We our organization some serious... We don't really care. Just tell us exactly what to do. Arab, Kirava... Percy Honeyhand and Hilda. Got do you. this right, and I can promise you a permanent place in our organization. Can I kill him? A word of warning, though. I don't want any of them killed. No. Bad for business. Oh. All right. Well, consider it done. If you need any details on your marks, I'll be here. Now get going. I'll be here when you're done. All right. So we got a little strong army to do. This is pretty routine. Out here. In case you've never done this quest before, each of the marks Kirava, Bersi Honeycut, and Kirava, Kirava, Bersi Honeycut, and Helga. They all have their weaknesses. We're going to start with Helga at the bunkhouse. We just fast travel the rift and get right beside her. Her organa, her place of business, rather. Around the corner here. Can I help? She is very attached to her statue of Debella. Just steal it and go talk to her. Please don't take the statue. Should I drop the Not statue in wall? In the wall? The no. Yeah. Here, take your gold. I hope you don't have to wait for her. That's that. Next, have to wait till business hours. Oh, what's still, still business hours? Into the pond, prawn. My husband Bercy will be the death. Hook up the flame spell. Hey, oh, he spends too much time worrying about rich. Destroy this vase here. Oh my word! No. Talk to Bercy. That was from Brynjolf. Get the message. Take your coin. Tell Brynjolf to leave us. And that's done. After you scare the crap out of the first two, the third one's gonna give it up, no problem. Whomever that is. So the last one, Kirava, here in the B and Barbs, is gonna give it up. You don't have to strong armor. Here for a room or some. I have a message from Brynjolf. Take this. Yeah, you you want to drink. This is about what the you say? She told me. And we're done. That's it. That's all. Let's take the good news to Brynjolf. <laughs> he shoots, he scores. So, job's done and you even draw the gold. But it's well done. done. Here you go. I think you'll find these quite useful. 
Judging okay, what's how next? You've handled those shopkeepers. I'd say you've done more than simply prove yourself. We need people like you in our outfit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's next? Now, if there are no more questions, to to be be you can yourself to what we're off. No handouts here. Okay, quiet, everybody. We're trying to listen to Brynjolf. Okay, Brynjolf said if there's no more questions, I'll show you what the operation is all about. Something like that. You can go through here into the ragged flagon. And I'll settle up Brynjolf. Let's go talk to Mercer. Hey, Mercer. Let's wait until Brynjolf's here before we begin. Mercer, this is the one I was talking about. Our new recruit. Bum skip. Be another waste of the guilt. Before we Bum skip. Continue, I want to make one thing perfectly clear. If you play by the rules, you walk away rich. You bring... Bum skip. Do I make myself clear? Yes, I understand. Good. Then I think it's time we put your expertise to the test. Wait a moment. Okay, now while they're, while they're talking, you can start looting the Thieves Guild chests here. They're available. And the Thieves Guild gear around your bed. Three items here. Very good, we did that one, that one. Let's go over here. You listen to their conversation. And when you get the option or the objective to talk to Brynjolf, that's when um, you go back to talk to Brynjolf. Don't forget to leave these weapons here. You can enchant those. There you go. Perfect. Welcome to the family, lad. I'm expecting you so, to make So, how do I get my cut of the spoils? Do as you're told and keep your blade clean. We can't turn a profit by killing. You should talk with Delvin, Mallory, and Vex. They know their way Can't around this place, and they'll be able to kick some extra jobs your way. Oh, okay, about the Golden Glow job. Let's just hustle it up to that. Golden Tell me about Glow that. Estate. We need you to teach him a lesson by burning down three of the estate's hives and clearing out the we safe do that. main house. That's right up our alley. The catch is that you can't burn the whole place to the ground. That important Dang it. client Mercer mentioned would be furious if you did. Okay. Uh, right. makes sense. The last thing we want to be doing is crossing our clients. What's your deal about Aaron Goth? Even the guild has a lot riding on this. And as soon as you get Don't this objective here, clear out Aaron Goth's safe. You can safely you tab out of the island. dialogue Those and you're free. Alright, so let's go to the, the Praxis room and get another set of these guild gear. A complete set this time. We can sell that for money. Right there, gloves. Good. Over here is the boots. And up there is the armor and a dagger let's just leave that heavy arse great sword there and we're done let's go talk to Tenelia get yet another set of peace guild gear and we're gonna sell them all back to her as much as we can and then talk to Dex and Delvin Tenelia she is. So you're the new recruit. Well, looks like you and I are going to have am. to get very well acquainted. Why is I'm that? I'm the fence down here. You come by anything you don't exactly own, and I'll pay you some coin for it. Minus a little slice for the guild, of course. Yeah. I can also provide a few supplies useful to our trade now and again. For a small fee. Uh -huh. Anything else you don't... Is there anything you don't charge sure. for? How about I get dirged to knock you over your head and... No, 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 okay. At the end of the day, you'll How about you give me my gear? Good. Then there isn't give much me my order. gear. Here's your armor. Just make sure Atta, girl. it's to good use. Yep, we're going to sell it right away. <laughs> Why don't you take a look at some of my merchandise and we'll see what kind of deal we can make. Okay. You have that, 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 that. Anything that we can disenchant, we're going to keep like that. And how much money does she have? Sell the, the armor. The two hoods and one of these beautiful. Until next time. Very good. Till next time. Now. Oh, you're Brynjolf's new protege, eh? Bex. Like much to what say you? Before we begin, I want to make two things perfectly clear. One. 
I'm the best infiltrator this rat hole of a guild's got. So if Not anymore. <laughs> two, you follow my lead and do exactly as I say. No questions, no excuse. Then we understand each other. Now, it's time to get your feet wet. And I don't want to waste a lot of time talking about anything but business. Okay. I'm what not sort of business? I'm not going to sugarcoat it for you. We're in a bad way down here. <laughs> she wastes time talking Who about Old Delvin other stuff besides business. Kind of curse. I think he's crazy. If you want okay, hustle opinion, up here. I business? You can get at business. And while you're at it, make a little bit of coin on Here we side. go. Okay, so we're going to start taking some extra jobs from Vex and Delvin. What we want is to get the jobs in the same city, and what we want the city we want is Windhelm. All right, these are extra jobs. If we get complete five extra jobs in the same city, we'll unlock the City of Influence quest. All right, so we're aiming for Windhelm. I handle the offering extra work. Shell, sweep, and heist jobs. Most of, if you don't like that kind of work, talk to Delvin. He runs the more up close and personal jobs. All right, we're going for burglary jobs. They're the easiest one to complete with Vex. Now the way it's random, it's completely random, the job, like what city gets assigned to you. However, on the PC version, pretty sure you could do this on the console version as well. If you pretty simple. Break take on a burglary house, job, grab a specific item and get out before they realize what's going on. The catch is you can't kill anyone who lives there or you forfeit the payment. You ready for some good old-fashioned burglary? Okay, now at this point with Vex, it's either I'm in or it sounds easy enough. What you're going to do is you're going to click on that, then immediately tab out of the dialogue, however you do that, exit the dialogue, and click on quick save. Is Whatever. It, think, Just get think it done. If you're one of us, Here's the job. Make trouble. Okay, so we got a quick save, and the job we got assigned to us was... Windhelm. Great. Okay. So we don't have to reload. Let's Reveal try this again. Life. I'm going to guess. save here. He just plucked you off the street and dropped you into the thick of things without telling you which way is up. Am I right? No, he told us which way was up. Can we steal your Harker loaf right in front of you? Bring your fight. Are you these skill types are real? Dropped you into the thick real tolerant. Okay, I know what I'm doing. On the other end, Let's just toss it up here through his dialogue. So, if you've got the Look at a few decades ago. Look, something out there is piss drug matters. I don't know who or what it is, but it's beyond just you and me. We've been cursed. That basically is the gist of what all that dialogue there, what he just told you. He thinks the Thieves Guild is cursed. I'll tell you what, that's where you come in. Let's just all you need to hustle do up to his... There we go. This. I heard like you're offering rose. extra work. I had all the fishing, numbers, and numbers bedlam, and job. bedlam jobs. Break into all your thing. Go talk to Vex. Okay, the easiest ones to do with Delvin are numbers jobs. Most Let's of the establishments in Skyrim keep their transactions recorded within business ledgers. Your job will be to change the numbers in those books so the shortfalls from our other jobs look legit. Feel like doing a bit of writing. Okay, here's the point here. I'll do it. What you're going to do is you're going to click on I'll do it. Immediately tab out of the dialogue and click on quick save very quickly. I'll Finally. do it. Tab out. Someone quick save. Back, there you go. And if you don't get wind home, just reload again. the quick Always. save. We got white run. White run. So let's try again. Just reload. And this time oh, you we got bad. solitude. So basically, I'm just going to fa uh, fast track this until I get a Windhelm job because I'm going to try again. I may have to like reload a few times. Pull up a seat. Solitude again. A so, what could I do for this you? This could take a minute or two. I'll see you on the. I'll see you on the flip side. Pull up a seat. Have a drink. Bingo, make changes in the ledger at the white file in Windhelm. Okay, so we got two jobs in Windhelm. That's exactly what you want. Numbers job and the burglary job. It's a done deal. Okay, one more very important step before we take or start doing these jobs and that's gonna come up first thing in the next video. As for this video, we're done here. Thanks a lot for watching. And if you thought this was remotely entertaining and or informative, you know what to do. Give me a give me a thumbs up.
subscribe to my channel, stuff like that there. See you next time for some more Pure High Elf on Legendary Difficulty. Hey guys, real walkthroughs like these are an endangered species here on YouTube. For a complete lowdown on the YouTube video game walkthrough scene, check out my Patreon page and please consider making a donation to yours truly, Major Slack, to help keep real walkthroughs alive on YouTube. You can donate as little as $1. That's $1, that's all. That's all it takes, alright? Thanks a lot, really appreciate it.